This is a video about how to make your own guitar humidifiers. These are my favorite humidifiers. This is an in the case guitar humidifier and this is a sound hole humidifier. Let's get started. First you need a soap dish and a couple of small containers like these pill boxes. You're going to need some sponges. A 5 8 inch paddle bit for the smaller holes and a 3 quarter inch paddle bit for the larger holes. Some string and uh, some scissors. Take your soap dish, take the lid off, and let's drill a hole in it. Now you'll notice that I've got a board underneath where I'm drilling. That's because I don't want to put a hole in the card table that I'm working on here. So we're just going to drill a hole with a three-quarter inch paddle bit and there it is. Actually that looks pretty nice. Okay, we'll do the other side. You want to be careful when you're drilling. Hold the lid so that it doesn't spin around. And uh, there you go. There's the two holes. Now if you want to, you can take a file or something and take the extra plastic out of that hole so it's a little cleaner. Let's change the bit now because we're going to drill a hole in the top of the pillbox. I'm taking out the 3 quarter inch paddle bit and putting in the 5 8 inch paddle bit. And here's the pillbox that I found. It works really well in the sound hole of the guitar. Uh, I take the lid off there and let's drill some holes. Drill the holes in the pillbox lid the same way you did for the soap dish. Make sure you hold the lid so it doesn't flip around or anything. Be careful you don't hurt yourself. Just drill it right in there, clean it up and we're done drilling holes. Put it all back together and we're ready to cut the sponges. Okay, I've got my package of sponges and I'm going to open it up. Take one of these out and um, the big soap dish is almost big enough just to hold a sponge but I need to cut a little bit off the sides. So, here we go. Now I'm going to speed this process up a little bit so you can see how I do it. I like to take a little bit off the edges, make it round. When you get it all done, you stuff it in and it's done. That's it. You've got your humidifier. Now for your pill box, you see I'm just going to take a marker and make a mark around uh, the pill box on the sponge to help me to figure out how big to make this and uh, I'll speed this process up a little bit here so you can see what it looks like but uh, you just cut it up just like so when you get it all trimmed up and done just put it in the in the pillbox side do the second one, put it in also, and, and that's it. Now we're ready to put the holes in the lid. This is a margarine lid, and on the end of the paddle bit is a little tip, and I'm just going to, instead of changing bits, I'm just going to take that paddle bit and drill a couple of holes, just like this. Makes a couple of nice little neat holes and uh, then I'm going to get some string and I'll cut a piece of string about so long put it through the hole like this and back down and tie an overhand knot a couple of overhand knots actually or you can make a real um, square knot that will hold really well and you see that I have the uh, string coming off the the underside of the lid 
and then you tie the pillbox onto it. That, that pillbox had a little loop on there, and so you just tie the pillbox onto it with the same two overhand knots or a square knot. And it's done. Just trim off the extra if you want to, like that. And there we go. It doesn't need to hang very far, Just you just need to be able to get it in the hole of your guitar. There's our finished product. Ta-da! Alright, now what we do is we take these sponges and we wet them, just like that, in the sink. Then you squeeze them out a little bit, make sure that they're not dripping all over the place. Put the lid on and you're ready to go there. Now you can take the sponges out of the pillbox if you want to, or you can just open it up like this, put the water in, and then squeeze it out like so. Here we go. And then I usually take a towel to wipe any excess water off the pillbox or off the lid, off the outside of either container because I don't want water inside my case and I don't want water inside my guitar. When you get it all done, take the soap dish, and I usually put it in the top like this. This humidifies the neck. It helps humidify this part, the upper part of the guitar. The in the hole humidifier goes in the hole like that. Then you just take the lid and snap it in on one of those frets and ta-da, you're done. That's it, that's what it does. Close it up. If you don't have the tools to make your own humidifiers, you can order both of these through quailstudios.com. This video has been produced by Quail Studios in St. George, Utah. YouTube channel, Quail Studios, become a subscriber. Watch for new videos, quailstudios.com. Thanks for watching.